reading through my emails and try to answer everybody's question and I don't remember whether I answered this um, from Northwood and he said what level of non-judgment do you have to get to 5d I can't remember if I answered this or not but it's it's he asks if it's pass fail or does sincere effort ca uh, count it's really not either one it's a matter of a vibratory state so if you are in a state of non-judgment that is appropriate for the fifth dimension where you will be safe to go and create there then you are in 5d if you are there and all of a sudden you become judgmental it'll kick you right out of 5d and you'll go back to 4d now in the process of the way we're doing it the chances of you doing that, bouncing back and forth from 5D to 4D, is pretty slim uh, because everyone's doing it pretty consistently and very carefully. So you're much more likely to just gradually, gradually, gradually get up there and you may dip a little bit. But the higher vibratory states you get into, the less um, variance there is. The higher you go, the less variance there is. So down in 3D Earth, there is a huge variance between a really low vibratory state of despair and happiness. There was a big gap there. The higher that you go, the smaller that gap is. It, it really becomes smaller and smaller. And you get a lot more fine tuning, really, is the best way of doing it. And you're, so you're getting more and more uh, better at your fine-tuningness. But you you really probably, until you, <clears throat> until you truly have non-judgment down, you won't be in 5D. Uh, you won't stay there. You won't go there and stay there. You may have a, a, a touch of it. You may flash to it, but you won't stay there. And as far as I can tell, there's no one creating uh, well enough that they could stay in 5D at this point because there's still a lot of things that you have to be able to do. You have to be able to understand we're all one. There can be no judgment whatsoever so that you can have no judgment so you wouldn't want, don't create badly uh, in 5D. Does that make sense? So it's really, don't worry about it. Uh, if you're heading in that direction and you've got that intent and you're working towards it, then it will happen exactly the way it's meant to. You cannot do it wrong. Uh, there isn't a better way than other ways. There is your way. And your way will be unique to you. It will be exactly as you had wanted it to be all along. You cannot mess this up. Okay? I want you all to hear me on that. You cannot mess this up. There is no better way than another way. That is a, a, a 3D timeline confusion concept. Because in reality, all of these ways are unique and you are doing it exactly as you were meant to do it. Okay? So you head towards it. Have fun with it. Play with it. Catch yourself whenever you can catch yourself being judgmental and going, oh, oops, got it. Catch it. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Until you habit yourself out of being judgmental. You habitualized yourself into being judgmental. You're just going to habitualize yourself out of being judgmental now. Okay? Does that make sense? Short and sweet? All right. That's it. Huge hugs. Love you guys so much. And I'll talk to you later. Bye now.